in Fallujah at the same time. Yes, when I got hit it was in 04 during Phantom Fury. Uh -huh. And uh, <laughs> we went out to do a refilling operation and supply. And somebody on the convoy said, let's go clear some houses while we're out here, which wasn't really our job, but the Marines are riflemen, so we did what we had to do. And as we were clearing some buildings, they started firing down the steps at us and we got pinned down. I got my friends out, fellow Marines, we got back. As I was getting my friend over to the medic, the medic was like, we gotta get you too, you were hit. And I was actually really relieved because being shot's one thing, but pissing on yourself, there's no living that down. It's hard to live that one down. There's no living that down, especially in Marines. You know, it's... So you were relieved that you had a gunshot wound too? Yes, yeah. yes. So how, <laughs> how did your care go after that? It was fine, I just patched it up and went back out. And yeah. From then on, I became you know, known as the guy that pissed on himself. So if you could have a message out there for any doctors or healthcare providers of how they could have helped someone like you and the walls you faced when you were going through healthcare, what would that be? Um, I don't know because I didn't have many walls. I mean, I had a pretty good experience overall. Uh, you know, it was just, you know, I guess if you ever encounter somebody that is actually shot in the future, just tell them, you know, it could be worse. You could have pissed on yourself. Yeah, there you go. It's good news. The battle continues. <laughs>